Hi, welcome to Mrs. Park's Mathland. Today, we are going to learn about the area of a parallelogram. This shape is a parallelogram because the bottom length is parallel to the top and the right side is parallel to the left. The bottom length is called the base. From the corner of the base, go straight up to the top. This vertical line is called the height. The base and height meet together, forming a right angle 90 degrees. Now, I am going to cut along the height to move this triangle to the other side. Let's see what happens. Slide to the right. Voila! I have rectangle. Then I can use rectangle area formula for the parallelograms. Area equals length times width. Area equals length times width. This rule is true for rectangles, squares, and parallelograms. Now let's apply our discovery to problems. First problem, identify the base and height of each parallelogram, then find its area. Look at the red rectangle. A rectangle is a parallelogram as well because the bottom length is parallel to the top and the right side is parallel to the left side. Let's count the base the bottom base, one, two, three, and four. So base is four cm. This little line segment is one centimeter. Then what is the height? Let's count. One, two, three. Height equals three cm. Area equals length times width. Area equals base times height. So 4 times 3, 12 square cm. Inside the rectangle are 12 little squares. That's the area. Now look at the green parallelogram. What is the base, bottom base? 4 cm. What is the height? 3 cm is the height or 3.3 cm is the height. Remember, base and height, they have to meet together forming a right angle 90 degrees. Therefore, 3 cm line segment is the height. Area equals base times height, 4 times 3, 12 square cm. These two shapes have the same area. Next, this parallelogram, 7 cm for the base. Then, what is the height? Slanted line 5 cm. That is the height or 4 cm that is the height remember height and base they have to be perpendicular forming 90 degrees forming 90 degrees therefore 4 cm is the height area equals length times width area equals base times height length times width Base times height, 7 times 4, 28 square cm. Now, it is your turn to do it. Down below, there are more practice problems. Thank you for watching. Area equal.